This is Tatiana Chornoval, a former nationalist member of parliament who is now fighting in frontline trenches, working as an anti-tank guided missile operator just north of Kyiv. Here, she describes her most recent hit. I switched it on and saw tanks on the screen. They just entered within the range of my missile. I took aim and destroyed the first tank. Interestingly, the rocket was flying for quite some time. Perhaps the tanks registered the rocket's launch and managed to turn back. But I shot it right at the fuel tanks and the ammunition load has detonated. The tank literally flew off the road and now it is somewhere in the road ditched in the forest. After that, we came under fire, not for long. All during this time, Russian military vehicles were turning back and escaping. So one destroyed tank was enough to stop the attack, for the column to turn back and run away. A high-profile anti-corruption campaigner, Tatiana, who is also a former journalist, was one of the leaders in the Euromaidan protests. She turned to politics in 2014 and was elected a member of the Nationalist and Conservative People's Front Party. But now she's part of a unit tasked with engaging and destroying Russian tanks and armoured vehicles to stop its approach on the Ukrainian capital. Tatyana is a war widow herself. Her husband, Mykola Berezhovi, served as a volunteer fighter in the right-wing paramilitary Azov battalion. He was killed during fighting in eastern Ukraine in 2014. 